Uh, let's see. Played Cleveland just a couple of days ago. Your thoughts on that game? How do you do it? We were very good on, on Sunday. Um, really liked the way we played. Our, our commitment without the puck was extremely strong, um, which was great to see. And, and that's been just a massive increase for us in the last 15 to 20 games. Our, our commitment uh, without the puck to being a winning hockey team has just risen dramatically, and it has to again tonight. They're an extremely talented team. Uh, you'd probably argue that they have the best lineup in our division right now. Um, you know, that's the American League. It's sometimes it's when you play teams. Um, and certainly Toronto's had a great season, but when you look on paper at, at how Cleveland is playing, swept Toronto last week before they played us and, and what their lineup looks like right now, they, they're an extremely dangerous team. Uh, we're going to have to be sharp tonight. <laughs> you know, that's a good question. Uh, I don't remember exactly what the lines were last game. It, it, uh, it, I mean, it, it seems to change every game, right? Call-ups and injuries and things like that. So uh, for the most part, I think the lineup is with getting Rusek back uh, is pretty similar. Um, Keith Scoff will not be in tonight. He was in Sunday, and that's just part of the plan of trying to get him more times to lift in the middle of the week so we can continue to gain his strength, um, you know, looking towards the future with them. Stacked up, and uh, you've been trying to rotate guys in and out a little bit here. Yeah, a little bit. Um, you know, last week we had a, we had a successful week, obviously, but but we every person that's here healthy played. Every player, um, extra forwards all played. Picard and Olszewski and Kisikov and Warren all played. All gave us really good minutes. All eight eligible defensemen all played, all gave us important minutes. You know, and that's that's what you want from your team. Uh, that that togetherness and whatever a guy's name is called, they're going to come and step up. Um, so that's that's critically important. And and like I said before, our commitment without the puck uh, has risen. I think our decor has been getting better and better and better. And I think it's also they're getting more support from our young forwards. In terms of the back checking, uh, than maybe they were, you know, two or three months ago. Crazy. Every time you think somebody's sort of falling by the wayside, all of a sudden Laval's winning again. It just it doesn't loosen up at all. Well, it's a credit to our division. Our, it, it, I've said it for two years now how good the North Division is, but Laval goes to Manitoba. Manitoba is one of the best teams in the Midwest and sweeps them. Um, and and what a what a great statement about how strong our division is, and that puts them right back in the mix of things. And as I said to you the other day, I know how good this division is, and uh, I'm not counting anybody out. Um, you're still in the same spot we were last week. Last week was a good week, and we're a little closer to second than we were a week ago, but uh, a good week, you're close to second, and a bad week, you're close to seventh. So we just got to keep our, our foot on the throttle uh, and, and stay focused on what we can control. Yeah, that was that was fun to see. Um, you know, I happened to be there. Uh, just, just I, I was taking my daughter to that game anyway. Um, so uh, that was fun to be there in person. Um, you know, and he and I talked this morning. You know, I think for him, it's you know, it's he's always believed he can play at that level, but then you do it, and it's confirmation. Um, and he was talking about you know all the things that that we've been hammering on him for a year and a half, and how hard you got to compete on the puck and, and you got to hunt pucks and forecheck and all the little details that allow your skill and your intelligence to shine. Uh, and he felt uh, very comfortable in that game. Uh, he felt like he belonged. Um, and, you know, I think he gained confidence from that. And hopefully now he comes back and, and shows that with us tonight. If you heard this stretch run, hopefully postseason game, just to have that NHL experience and in a high pressure in the yeah, it, it, we saw it help, um, you know, Paterka and Quinn and guys like that last year um, where they, they get a little taste. They see how close they really are. Um, Kevin Adams has said that to me before. Like, we, those four guys all probably could have been called up, Murray Byro, Weisbach, and Rusek at, at any point this year because of how good they've played here. Um, and there just hasn't been a lot of forward injuries to Buffalo, which is great. Um, and Kevin and I have talked about that, and he's lived it as a player. It's like even though we're only an hour away, you can feel like you're a thousand miles, you know, um, and that you're not even close. It can feel hopeless at times. And so, for Lukash, 
that experience, that confidence, that belief that 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 is how close you are, you are right there, um, is is very helpful. Uh, but I also think it gives life and hope to other guys um, to see a guy go up uh, that they consider probably a peer at this level and perform as well as he did. Uh, probably helps create more buy-in that the things they're doing here matter and they're working and, and they'll be ready when they get called. Great. He almost got a little bit of a taste of it there. Yeah, that was great. Um, I think it says a lot about both of them, right? Uh, it says a lot about Yuri, uh, what a good teammate he is. Uh, and those are things we know, but now, you know, other people start to see that. Um, what a great young man he is, how much he looks up to Lukash, and how much Lukash has meant to him this year. His first year being in North America, his first year pro, having another check to, to lean on. Uh, but I also think it says a lot about Lukash and, and how Lukash has treated Yuri, uh, the kind of teammate he's been to him, the kind of friend he's been to him, uh, that Yuri felt he needed to be there for.